Hey everybody, so I thought I'd show you what I got in my Sephora VIB haul. I'm a little bit late on this. I got this almost two weeks ago now, I think, and I'm just now getting around to filming it, but I love watching these hauls um, and what people are trying out, so I thought you guys might enjoy too. I didn't get too, too much, but the products I got, I'm extremely excited about. The first one I actually just filmed a review for that I'll be putting up after this video. It's from Cover FX, and it's the Custom Cover Drops. That's the box there. I've been experimenting with it since I got it. It comes in a cute little bottle like this. You'll have to watch the review for more info, but basically you can take, it's like a pigment, and you can mix it with a moisturizer, an oil, a serum, a foundation, a BB cream, whatever, and it just puts the pigment into that product. So like today, all I have on is moisturizer with a with a, like a couple little drops of this mixed into my moisturizer, and that looks like I'm wearing foundation, but it feels like nothing like a moisturizer so it's a really cool product definitely look for the review on that the next thing I got is just a backup for an item that I've bought a few times now and I know I love it's from NARS it's the light reflecting setting powder pressed that's what it looks like there I haven't opened it yet because where is mine I still have one on the go that's what it looks like mine looks a little dingy it's just from putting my brush on my face with foundation and then back in here. Um, but it's the most amazing powder ever. You can't even see that you're wearing powder and it keeps your skin oil free but like it still looks like it has life. It's just a wonderful powder. So since it was the VIB sale I thought I would take advantage of that and, and get it back up. The next product I got is from Tarte and it's called the Poppy Picnic. Look at that cute box. And the packaging itself is just as cute little mini palette. Look how pretty that is. Oh my gosh, I love it. So up my alley. And then when you open it, that's what comes inside. This appeals to me so much. There's six eyeshadows. They're all matte, which is wonderful because I've been loving matte eyeshadows for a while now. And then a blush here, which I didn't realize would be quite so shimmery. Um, it's a really pretty color. I just didn't realize how much shimmer would be in it. See how pretty that color is? Let's watch it for you. So, I don't know, maybe in the middle of summer I'll be wearing it. There, that's a very light swatch here. Let me do a little bit more. There it is there. So it's very, very shimmery. Um, not totally my favorite, but a beautiful color. But the eyeshadows are fabulous. I'm wearing a whole bunch of them on my eyes right now. They have a really great pigment. They blend really well. So they look like. And... They're just, um, that was a really light swatch. They're just neutral, so I feel like if I travel, I can just grab this and I've got light to dark, so I can do kind of any look with them. And they're really, really good quality and the palette's really cute. So that's what I got. And then the last thing was a bunch of samples. I already got rid of a whole bunch of them. They were perfume samples, which, meh. I don't really like perfume. I always try them out to see if I'll fall in love with one, but I didn't. And then I got this, um, what is this? From Clinique. It is the new 2-in-1 Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer. Just little sample sizes like that. And the color Golden. That seems dark, so I may have to hold out on that to try around summertime. Let me know if you want to see a review on that. And then I got my little birthday gift, which is the NARS Duo of lip products. The first one is called... I don't know what it's called. Maybe it will say on the packaging. Happy one year birthday. Okay, I think this is the name because I'm comparing it to the other one. Rikugin. Rikugin? Mm, probably butchered that a lot, but I'll show you the swatch of that. It's like a neutral mauve color, which is actually quite pretty. That's what the pencil looks like. Really big size, which is great. And the other one is a bold red called Cruella. Let's watch that beside it. It's more like a berry red. Or a blood red, I suppose. So yeah, I got that one. And is that it? Yep, that's it for my Sephora VIB haul. If you guys have any questions, let me know down below. I hope you guys enjoy. And thank you so much for watching. Bye!